Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. We are here. Okay, so I got a very unexpected phone call this morning from the vet. And I think I found a really, really good vet, honestly. Um, he told me that he doesn't want me to waste my money. It's too early to, to see Jane. Like, the incident of her getting laid only happened two days ago. And he's like, I can't tell you anything unless you want me to just start doing blood work right now. And I can tell you about her overall health, but I can't tell you anything related to the incident or the pregnancy. Like, that that doesn't happen that quick. It's not like humans. And so I was like, okay, you know, listening to his advice. And so we rebooked the appointment for two weeks out. Um, I'm going to stay here. Um, I'm at the marina with my friend. She lives on a boat full time. And I'm about to walk down the docks and meet her. Jane's in the van. I don't know. There's other dogs that live on this dock. Oh my gosh, it's so bright. Um, and so I don't want her to go near any other dogs right now. So she's going to um, be by herself. Hold on, I gotta go look at that. I thought that was an outlet. I'm always looking for like water spigots and outlets. No matter where I go. It doesn't matter if I need it or not. <laughs> I just look for it. And I'm like, ooh, what is that? I want to move my van into this field. I would just have to drive my van through a puddle and then I could park my van right there. And I would have this as a view out my front window. Look, 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 those are turtles. They're sunbathing. How cute. Okay, so I first thought I was like gonna come out here, sit on the dock, finish drinking my coffee and put my feet in the water. Um, there's like a film on the water, like on the top of the water, there's like a weird filmy and I don't want to put my feet on that or in that. I don't know. It looks like it's like maybe oil or gasoline or something. I don't know. It's very weird. I don't like it. Oh my god, we're moving. Oh my gosh, okay, hold on. We're moving again. Okay. It's all good, it's all good, it's all good. <laughs> it's funny. Oh, the sun is making my eyes water. <laughs> I stopped taking my allergy medicine because I thought the bee pollen was all I needed. I think I was wrong. <laughs> it's coming back. Oh boy. Oh boy. Don't sneeze. Don't sneeze. So everybody, this is Megan. What is your name on TikTok and on YouTube so I don't mess it up because I mess it up every time? Sailing Spider. Spyridon. Sailing Spyridon. We're going to get smoothies. back in the van. So, we went to the antique store, we went and got smoothies, we went to Panera Bread, because I guess they have a drink special thing. It's pretty good too. Um, but I wanna show you guys what I got. So this one is a, hold on, let me read it. 
yeah, this one's made in New England and it actually has chestnut wood on the end of it, which is so cute. This is actually Rolex. Can I get it to focus? Hold on, maybe if I'm not moving. Yeah. And I believe, yeah, Rolex is a Switzerland company. Yeah. And those are my two new spoons. So I'm gonna polish spoons tonight. <laughs> I still have my grandmother's entire set of silver because I just know how to take care of it. I love old vintage things. Look, <laughs> 333, what's up grandma? I love you. Okay, so now I'm getting my, I almost said laundry. What is this? Um, oh gosh. Okay, so we're getting our shower stuff together. I'm gonna finish eating the burrito from last night. And the next step is, I want to find something like really cute to wear because we're having a barbecue tonight. And like, this is a really tight knit community. It's kind of cool. Like everybody that lives at the docks and lives aboard, they all kind of hang out and there's like this little community barbecue area and so I want to find something that's cute and so I can meet all of their neighbors because a lot of them are leaving and that's what I'm finding out by talking to a lot of them a lot of them are preparing their boats to leave this port because they're raising the rent here um, it was $800 a month but now it's getting raised to $1,400 a month so they're literally doubling the rent and then they're also making it a construction zone. And so a lot of the boaters are just like, we're out of here and I came at the right time. Cause it's like, party, 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 barbecue, barbecue. I'm excited, but I have to find clothes. Um, this is where all my clothes live. It's just like a lot of packing cubes, but all my packing cubes are like, they're labeled because I don't want to search for a bunch of stuff. So each packing cube, I use these little luggage tags and it's like, this is sweater shirts and jumpsuits. Actually, this might be cute. The Marina shower. We already plugged in the Blue Eddy because this needs to charge because I might have to charge this battery to my other battery. Um, but yeah, I don't think there's a light in here. Or no, there is. Where's the light switch? I'm so used to Planet Fitness. <laughs> wow. All right, so we're back at the van. That was embarrassing, but I feel very acquainted with the neighborhood now. That's good. Um, so we're meeting up with like a couple of the travelers from here and we're having a barbecue. I think I already said that. And I wanted to bring something because like, that's what you should do when you're invited. You have to bring something, you know, offer up. So I have this garlic honey and one of the other girls said that she has a pineapple. And so grilled garlic honey pineapple is so good. So I'm gonna bring that. I don't know if I should bring the goat cheese and then maybe like these, these, cause I mean, I got a lot of it. 
And then um, I also have like some balsamic glaze so I can like scoop out some goat cheese and make like a little cheese platter and then like drizzle some balsamic glaze on it. And that way everybody can like snack on some pretzels and goat cheese. Right? That sounds good, right? Because I have to buy new goat cheese anyways. I want a new flavor. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. And for anybody who's wondering, this is still good, okay? So what you do is when you buy goat cheese, literally just put it in a jar and cover the entire thing with oil. Like put oil in the jar so every little cube that you're tossing into the jar is coated with oil. And then boom, you have a preserved, shelf-stable goat cheese. It's no longer taking up my fridge and going bad. Okay, we gotta put the dates away. I'll just keep eating these, man. They're so addicting. Um, yeah, so we can't do that. Okay. All right, this is the fit. I'm wearing these cute, I'm so used to a vertical angle, man. But I'm wearing these cute pants and this cute top and flip flops. And I think I'm gonna have to do this in sections because I need to carry like this big old bag. Um, I made the jip, the jip, the dip, the jippity dip dip, anyways. Um, I gotta carry this. I also have to take the Blue Eddy to the gazebo and plug it in. Um, I think I'm going to film this on just my phone and not carry this camera because um, I just want to spend time with people and not worry about filming or anything. So I think this is where I'm going to call it actually. Um, I'm going to have a good night. I'm going to have a great night. I'm gonna meet new travelers. There's another lady that came, she already saw the van and was like, wow. And I wanna have some good conversations. That's what I want. So thank you all for coming. I hope you enjoyed my video and I'll see you on the next one.